Hello YouTube, this is Everything is Tech, and today I'm going to show you how to connect uh, a dual view monitor. It, this could be either a television or uh, an actual monitor. The method I'm going to use today is the HDMI method, and this is going to be connecting uh, my laptop, it's an XPS Dell, to, uh, to my HD t uh, HDTV, which is around 28 inches. And of course, if you don't know, it's a Sanyo. So, here we go. Okay, before we move on, if your computer does not have an HDMI slot, that means your computer has been made after, I believe, 2007 or 8. So, you're going to need to look at my other video, which will show you how to connect through S video, which I will put in, uh, in the video response or a link towards it, like um, on the screen. So here we go. Okay, so look for the HDMI slot for your computer or laptop. My laptop um, has an HDMI slot to the to the left. Go ahead and plug the HDMI cable in. Okay, it's so that's plugged in. Oh, I gotta go to my HDMI here. Uh, I'll get back to you. I think it kind of fell somewhere. Okay, after I managed to get back my HDMI cables, go ahead and plug in the other end into wherever your television has a slot for the HDMI. And plug that in. Okay, it's plugged in. Okay. Now, generally, I do believe you're going to be using Vista. Your laptop or computer is going to have Vista, so uh, you're going to need to right click. Okay, then go to Nevita Control Panel. Go ahead and click that. Then it says Set Up Multiple Display. Okay, now if you didn't turn your television on already, please do so. Okay, so after you turn your television on, which I didn't do, I just did that right now. Go to the home, whatever, the home place. Go to right click in the main page or whatever. Go to Nevada control panel. And then you're going to have all these options in the left hand corner. You might want to go to set up multiple displays. And then since we're setting this up in dual view. Go to configured independently from each other. Click that. Go to apply. Hit apply. And you should have this display on the laptop. And that kind of display, whatever your screen saver is on the uh, computer. Go ahead and click yes. Now, now basically you can do a lot of things with this. Uh, dual view HD TV or monitor for example if you want to right click and go to uh, personalize and go to display settings like that you can make your HD TV or your second monitor uh, your main monitor versus identify so you know which one is your main monitor one two so go to two so you know that's your HD TV. Go hit this is my main monitor. Apply. And that will be your main monitor. Like that. And it Okay. And if you want to change the back, do the same thing. Go to one. Um this is my main monitor. And hit apply. Okay, change back. Another thing which is really useful and it's really the main good feature of dual view in which that is my opinion. You can actually make your mouse drag onto the other screen and you could uh, shift any windows onto that screen. Basically what you need to do is go to your second monitor, your HDTV, click on that and click extend the desktop onto this monitor. Go ahead and mark that. 
you press OK. So now, as you can see, I can bring my mouse to the edge of the screen over here. And my mouse will appear on that screen. I'm sorry my you know these aren't close together so it is a bit hard and confusing. And same thing you could kinda like click on that and drag that to the edge and you could just put it up on your main display. You could do this with uh anything so this is very really useful if you do more than one thing at, at a time like listening to music on the second one second display and maybe typing up a quick um, quick essay or anything you know it's pretty handy in my opinion so thank you for watching if you like um, if you have any questions or comments please do comment and rate if you like them uh, rate them video and if you like my videos, please do subscribe. Thank you.